Hey, hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to WFSO Bucks Talk, um, where, you know, the Bucks finally got a win in Toronto, 128-112, to and it was a big game, and it was a good game, especially, you know, Giannis wasn't playing, and you got Chris Middleton doing okay, and you got Demi Litter with an awesome game, and Beasley finally stepped up. So, yeah, it was a big game, and, you know, and, you know, some of the bench just stepped up and, you know, did their thing, but it was just crazy that, you know, they came up with that much, and, oh, wow, I, yeah, which it was kind of odd that I'm looking at right now that I thought on OG and Nobi would be playing, he must have been out. So Giannis was out with a calf strain. I didn't know that until like about minutes before the game. So that happens. But um, let's see. Can I look at quarter scores over here? I can't even. I can look at team stats. So let me click to that first before we talk about the scores of players and stuff like that. Um. 44 out of 85 from the Bucks from the field goal. Um, 38 of 96 from Toronto. 51.8% field goals. So they did better than Toronto did with Toronto having 39.6. Three-point range. Uh, Bucks, um, this is like a season high for just the team itself, like 20 or 39. And Toronto didn't do that good in three-point shooting, um, 9 of 33. With a 27.3%, and Bucks has a 51.3%. Uh, free throws, uh, oh, they was almost perfect. So, that was shocking. Um, Toronto did well, too. Um, with 20-21 um, uh, with 95.2% free throw shooting. And Toronto with 27-31, 87.1% uh, free throw shooting. Um, the Bucks really got out rebound in this one, oh, especially on the offensive glass and defense. Well, off, off, yeah, especially the offensive glass, they got out rebound, twenty six to nine. Um, total rebounds. Uh, Toronto had the edge over the Bucks, fifty five to forty one. Um, Toronto had more assists, uh, twenty eight to twenty five, and Toronto had more steals than the Bucks did, ten to eight. But the Bucks had more blocks than the Toronto did on um, nine to eight. So yeah, um, what a crazy game! So let's go back to the box scores and let's go with that. Um, yeah, Chris Milton with eleven points, four assists. Five rebounds, one to two from the three point line, five and nine from the field, which is not bad shooting for like limited minutes. Brook Lopez had 10 points, four assists, eight rebounds. He had seven blocks as well. So, yeah, that's a good number for blocks. Uh, one to three from three and four to ten from field goal. Um, sorry, um, Malik Beasley with the, not had the team high, but, um, well, we'll talk about him in a bit, but he had 30 points, four rebounds, eight to 11 from three, 11 to 14 from the field. Damian Litter, I think he had the game high, I believe. Yeah, he did with 37 points, 13 assists, four rebounds. 4 of 10 from 3, 9 to 18 from the field. And from the bench, um, you got Bobby Portis, um, 18.7 rebounds, 2 of 3 from 3, and 7 to 11 from the field. So it looks like um, Bobby Portis is getting his, you know, three-point stride back, so which is pretty good. And um, Cameron Payne um, with 13 points, 2 assists, 1 rebound. Three of four from three, four of eight from the field. And 
Um, it seems like the um, Toronto starting five was doing something, especially um, Scotty Barnes, but we'll get to him in a minute. Packham Siakam with 11 points, 5 assists, 7 rebounds, 0 2 from 3, 4 of 9 from the field. Scotty Barnes had the team high with 29 points, 7 assists, 9 rebounds, 3 of 3 from 3, 11 of 19 from the field. Yeah, Joel Peretti. But did they win? Toronto didn't win. Good. <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, 13 points, uh, one assist, 11 rebounds, so double-double for him. And, yeah, I did forget to mention that, you know, um, Damian Lillard did have a double-double. So, I apologize about that. Um, Joe Peretti, 6-10 um, from the field, 0-0 zero, zero from three. Um, Dennis Schroeder on only played like 23 minutes. He only had nine points, five assists, three rebounds, one to four from three, two of nine from the field. Grady Dick had 11 points, two assists. Uh, <laughs> uh one to six from three and two of ten from the field. Um, oh, Thaddeus Young played a little bit. Precious Achua um, had 11 points, four rebounds, one to two from three, four to seven from the field. And Chris Boucher had nine points, nine rebounds, one to three from three, two to eight from the field. I think it's Mikhail Flint. I might have got it wrong, so sorry if I botched your name. Seven points, five assists, three rebounds. 0 8 from 3, 3 of 11 from the field. And, Jay, and Jimmy Daniels, uh, 7 points, 1 assist, 4 rebounds, 1 to 4 from 3, 3 of 10 from the field. And. It does. Um, yeah, that's, yeah, that's right, 3 of 10 from the field. Um. I'm sorry, because normally they'll say, like, when's the. Um, Next game that, um, you know, the next time they play each other, um, don't have that on here, but I think it was somewhere around, I think it's either next month or January. So I'll probably correct that at the next video because the next video I'll probably going to end up doing it on the laptop instead of, you know, doing it by phone. But, um, the next team they play will be a in-season tournament game they play against charlotte in charlotte and i think it's a six o'clock start so yeah um right now like with the they showed it earlier with miami um leading the um leading group b with two wins and bucks only got one got the knicks and knicks wizards one and one and I, I didn't see Charlotte, so I don't know what's what's going on with that. But um, guys, uh, thanks for listening and watching. Um, I'm gonna see how I'm gonna end up doing this in the um podcast. So I'm gonna try to work this video in. Just to say, I'm gonna try something. But um, please follow us on our um podcast you get your wherever you get your podcast from um you can go to spotify or just look for wrestling fans speak out and you will find it so please follow us um also you guys on youtube um like this video give it a like um subscribe to the channel um check out like our um videos my past videos if you like Milwaukee Bucks content and wrestling content this will be the channel for you so while sponsors art from the heart um check out the drawings on there on Facebook so go on Facebook and look for art from the heart and you'll find it and moving dudes um you in Florida or Wisconsin I'm um, Wisconsin I'm sorry um <laughs> find uh 
you can, if you need to move in Wisconsin and in Florida, they'll be the ones to help you move. So it's like within the state. So just, you know, give them the call. Call LaShawn, 414-807-4299. And um, until the next video, which will probably would be um, Friday, or the next podcast will be on Friday about the Charlotte game, and also talk about um, Friday night. Well, maybe no, not Friday night SmackDown. Um, we normally talk about that on the weekend, but um, full uh, AEW full gear. Uh, I think that's the no, that's. Pay per view before you know the Survivor Series pay per view, so should be interesting. So those are the next two videos in podcast. So just watch out for those. But until then, you guys have a good one.